In the past, it was viewed quite differently, but substance abuse is not a problem we can arrest our way out of. You know, years ago, the philosophy was it wasn't our problem. If somebody violated drug laws, you had to lock them up and let the courts deal with them. But, you know, it, it's a community. We need all the stakeholders to solve this problem more than arresting people. Today, a jail diversion program called the Blackstone Valley Connector is helping law enforcement by giving them tools to connect individuals and families with help when it may seem that all hope is lost. Nowadays, we're dealing with people with mental health and addiction issues that we were never trained for. So we need support from the community, and that's what uh, this program provides us with, is some support. Our goal has always been life safety. How we accomplish that, however, has changed. We arrested our way out of every problem, and we found out that that doesn't work. People uh, go through the system, and they end up dying on the streets. So if our, truly our goal is life safety, we have to find another way to come at this problem. I think the officers feel a little more comfortable when they go to respond to a call. Uh, for whether it's an opioid overdose or a mental health issue, you give them a fall. They, they can not only to the victim, but to the family. Uh, they can offer them some other type of assistance than us speaking to them for a few minutes at the scene. Police are often the first on the scene, which is a huge responsibility when it comes to the fate of the individual they're there to either arrest or assist. Police-supported addiction recovery is becoming the rage throughout the country. It actually started here in Massachusetts. Uh, but some form of using police officers as the entry point into the recovery system rather than the entry point into the criminal justice system. Police officers come into contact with addicted people whether they like it or not. Uh, having a resource available to send them to outside of the criminal justice system to get help uh, is a godsend to some of these people. First Responder Friday is brought to you by Dunkin' Donuts.